Hello everyone, this is Lloyd from Bisfo. In this tutorial, I just want to recap quickly on specials and working with specials and setting them up. What I'm going to do first is just a recap, depending on what version you have, I'm just going to reset my columns, my column order. And the reason for that is, yeah, depending on your version, um, there is an extra column that we want to see. So we've got the column orders um, by default, but what we're looking for is we're looking for our special discount. I'm going to put that one there. And then what I'm also looking for is my special price, special retail price. All right, so just to recap, we're going to do specials. Um, specials and promotions, they could be seen as two different things. Um, specials we typically run with our Black Fridays or Black Mondays, Cyber Mondays, and just silly discount days. And these two columns are quite important. This is just going to help you quite a bit. So let me save this column order. Okay, good. So first thing I want to show you is um, this tab. So we've got a tab here and we've got a midweek special. I'm going to show you how to set that up. But very important, um, as per normal, this bar on the top is actually our filter. So what I've done is I just filtered a midweek special, but there's no items listed here. Yes, I can still see that there is um, specials with prices listed, um, but they're not going to trigger because there's no special set up. To set up a special, it's quite easy. I just click on um, new. Uh, let's call it Cyber Monday. And the only ticks I want to leave on is active. Um, a lot of clients make the mistake to allow sales only for this period. This is more for your liquor stores where you do not want to sell outside of the period, but we don't want that. And in this case, we have um, quite a few options. So we can set them daily. Um, which is just the time it runs per day we can set for a specific period which means there's now a date coupled um, and we can set for specific days in the week which means I can select um, this could be maybe happy hour um, so just for simplicity sake I'm just gonna say say set daily and uh, let's make this one a P for PM and there we go so I've got cyber Monday running um, which may be a good, not good example, but every morning from that time to that time. Click save. All right, good. So now I've got Cyber Monday filtering. There's no products to it. So what we want to do is we want to get some products listed onto um, the special. So I'm going to go back, back to view. Um, and we can now, let me click on search because obviously there's not a lot of products, but you might want to search. So let's say I go and I search for pie. You can see there's um, pies. So let's say I want to take these ones. So I've used my shift button and um, selected all of them. Now I can say add to special. Good. So they are now added to my special. If I go back to my specials and I say view, I can see there's my items. Now what we want to do is we want to start looking um, at our prices. So currently there's no discounts set up for this item. And what I can do, there's different ways. I can go to products, I can go to price updates, I can go to special. So what I'm going to tell the system is take my retail price and subtract um, a discount from it. So let's make it a 10% discount. Uh, let's see what that looks like. It's telling me I need to select the items. So I'm just again going to select the items. Um, if there was a lot of items that would have the same price, I would go select all rows and I'm going to go back to this one I'm going to say price updates uh, set discount so I can apply it by default it's um, set special price including that um, you do have other options but just leave it on the default uh, it's saying make a backup so please do make your backup or export your products you say yes uh, the backup is not for the system gonna make a mistake or a bug it is um, simply user driven and percentage so i'm going to type in 10 percent all selected yes so what we are seeing now is we've got a price which is minus 10 percent there's my my price and i've got a new price on that one uh just as a tip as well so a lot of people s would want to adjust the price further so i could select all of them again and i would say i want rounding to be 99 so i'm just going to click round and now we've got a, a nice round price but remember you can see um, your discount is is different 
to what you're expecting. The other option, just for some speed, if I go and I say set price on enter, what this means is normally if I press my enter key, um, I would get the ability to do a, a stock take on the fly or stock count. So I'm going to say set the price uh, on enter and this would simulate this button. So I could set the price to something else. Let's make it 10. Uh, but because I've set this one, I can actually move with my mouse and my keyboard and I can press enter on the keyboard and also set this value. The same with this one, um, set discount. So I can click on that one and I can press enter and now I can enter a custom discount. Let's put it back to uh, 10%. All right, good. Um, then some more tips maybe. Let's just go back to search. If I'm, I'm going to say view all, if I wanted to remove these items from the special, let's just go back to special again. What I can do is I can say um, price update, uh, reset special price to zero. And again, I need to select all the items, products, reset special price to zero. So what does mean? You'll see that it, it is showing it would be minus 100% discount, but the system won't allow a special to go through of, of zero. If I wanted to remove these items, I can right click, I can go to edit, I can go to my specials, and I can remove these items from my specials. And again, this is the options you saw earlier, is I can select a bunch of items, or I can just select uh, one item. But if it was me, I would use this item, this navigation, just say add to special. So it's quite simple to pick some um, some spe uh, items and just add them to your special. So guys, that's an overview um, of your specials. Um, I hope it helps. Um, good luck with your um, specials and uh, Cyber Mondays and Black Fridays coming up. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to pop a mail at info.bizfo.co.za and the team will see how they can assist.